back out here being part of this with the guys and playing for Coach Kelly was, uh, was your decision to, to come back this year? A big decision. I mean, I'm just happy to be out here today, blessed to be out here with my teammates. We got a lot of work to get accomplished going forward, but it was really exciting to be back out here for the first day. What was it like out there? It seemed pretty high energy, lots of uh, repetitions in the whole High energy, fast tempo. We weren't, uh, we haven't been accustomed to that practice kind of practice style, so this was the first time for everybody, players and coaches included, besides Coach Pelham, I believe, Coach Ass, who worked with uh, Coach Kelly at Horton and um, in the league, so it was different, but we're excited though. How did it feel to go through it? Tiring? It's, it's, it's an adjustment. It's the one thing to be in shape, um, but it's another thing to be in football shape. So we got to get that squared away going forward. Did you know that going in? Did they prepared you that the reps are going to come that fast? They said it was going to be fast, but it's one thing between, um, you know, you hearing it and you actually doing it. What's the biggest adjustment when you're, when you're going fast? Knowing your, your assignments, getting every, everybody lined up, especially me being a safety, getting the linebackers lined up, telling the corners what we uh, have on defense, what we the safety, what I'm doing, what the inside linebackers doing, outside linebackers doing. So it's just a lot of communication on the field. What's the biggest adjustment in coaching style with Coach Az from compared to what you already what you had last year? Um, they take it step by step. They break everything down. Um, we had amazing coaching staff last year, but I, I believe this uh, is a great coaching staff as well, and they're preparing us to be successful this year. What's the biggest change for you position-wise in a 3-4? Um, I'm going to get a lot of help, i say. Um, I know last year I was playing for prior maybe playing in the box. So sometimes this year I'll be in the box, I'll be back, I'll be in coverage. I get to you know, kind of freelance, but uh, within the defense. Does it enable you to freelance more? I, I believe so. Um, I'm, I'm excited for my position on this team this year. What have you thought about working with uh, Coach Kelly? Coach Kelly is an awesome, uh, awesome coach. Um, everything is so detailed, and he'll critique you from the first thing you do to the last thing you do, every step by step. So that's going to be um, tremendous for us going forward as we prepare for the uh, upcoming season. How about Coach Rhodes? What have you gotten from him? Coach Rhodes, he loves to teach. He's a teacher, and he's going to break down everything and take you step by step. And if you don't um, understand it, he'll repeat it again until you do understand it. He'll find different ways for different guys and teach them. Um, the same techniques, but in, in different ways. So they, every person, um, every person learns different, and every, every person will pick it up differently. With Kenny Young gone, how has that changed the defensive leadership roles? Are you kind of that main guy now, and taking that leadership role? I, I kind of felt like I was like that last year, but um, guys, younger guys might have to step up. Really, uh, we don't have uh, just say in the core. We'll get Josh Woods back, and he has a lot of experience, but. Um, it's just a different, whole different team. New people, we're going to have new leaders. So it's an exciting, it's going to be an exciting journey. Is there an excitement amongst you guys right now that maybe you're starting something that could be special? I believe so, just by the way we've been working through one of our workouts with the team, with the uh, coach Wintrick and his um, staff in the weight room and just on, like, on field ready prep and stuff like that. Like we get a, get a chance to really gel, coming back in the evening time, spending a lot of time together as a team. So I feel like we're growing closer as a unit. It, it will be impactful going for this season. Coach Kelly has gotten a lot of publicity for his sports science program with things like hydration tests and sleep monitoring and stuff like that. You, is, he, is he instituting any of that here as far as the way he runs things and expects you guys to do things like that? He expects us to hydrate ourselves to uh, a lot throughout the day. Um, we have um, the second meal that's been put in place for us in the evening time, which has been tremendous for us. We didn't, we didn't have that in the past. We usually just eat once uh, once a day in the morning time. So he's real big on feeding us. We get weekend meals now um, to take home, so the players don't be hungry on the weekends. And we hydrate ourselves on the weekends through eating and um, drinking a lot, of, a lot of those things. We wear our GPS. I have one on right now um, for the strength that the monitor will be doing throughout the practice and if we're if our bodies are not allowing us it seems like we're getting too tired, you know, yeah, shut us down. So it's a lot of sports science and it's, it's gonna be beneficial for um, that information for the, uh, all those coaches. The second meal is like a second breakfast basically or what is it? Um actually it's like more so like dinner like oh, okay. lunch type of dinner thing. It's at like region around four four fifteen. Okay. Yes, I I'm assuming it's not pizza. It's <laughs> no, it's um just say grilled chicken, pasta, you know, the long, a lot of healthy food, but a lot of good food at that.